Hello guys, how are you? Welcome back to my channel, The Rich Post. Myself Ajay, and I hope you are doing great. So, friends, in this working video, I'm going to show you Angular 16 Booster 5 Four Power Working Demo. So, friends, before showing you Working Demo and code, I must say, please watch the video till the end and please subscribe my channel for latest Angular updates. So, guys, here we go. So, guys, I must say, it will be good for front-end Angular developers as well. So guys, here we go. See the working demo. Here is my Angular 16 working point and with booster 5. And now, I will show you the working demo as well. See guys, here are 4 buttons. Pop over on top, on right, on bottom, on left. Now, I am going to click on these buttons. First, on top, works well. On right, works well. On bottom, works well. And left, also works well. So guys, have you seen all 4 pop-ups? Are working well see friends just brilliant and now I will tell you how to implement that very simple first we need angular demo project then we need to install booster 5 with command and install booster and guys also I will share the course snippet link as well so no need to worry about the course snippet link as well I must say let me show you first we need to install Bootstrap and then pop popper base slash code then ng serve ng serve command wait the project generating browse application bundle and guys then we need to add these scripts and styles inside our angular.json file like I did see in a style I added booster min css and script I added min.js file and guys after it we need to run ngsurf command then is my html component app.component.html file you will find this file inside source app folder here is that file inside it I added my booster Pop over code. Here is that. And then inside my app root component.ts file, I import pop over class from booster. And then the method ng on initialize, I have add the pop over toggle event on all the buttons having data bs toggle popover attribute like here you can see the buttons having attribute data bs toggle popover will we have popover toggle event as well and that's it and you can see it's working fine just brilliant so guys this is the main event. I can say main method. We install booster file toggle instead of our Angular 16 application. Document query selector having this attribute. For each edit of our node. That's it. Works well. And guys, if you are new. In Angular 16, then you can visit my blog, therichpost.com, and find more tutorials related to that. See, to refresh, I have added Angular 16 Booster 5 model pop up reactive form with validations. Works well. See, guys, with proper working demo and proper course snippet as well. So, guys, I hope this tutorial will be good for you and if you will have any kind of query suggestion or requirement then feel free to comment on this video also please contact me via my blog i will share all the details inside this video description and press in the end i must say thank you for watching this video thank you have a nice day take care bye bye